Alright guys, before this video starts, I wanted to let you guys know I will be giving away 250 credits. These are worth a lot of money in the game. To enter the giveaway, the requirements are very simple. All that I ask is that you are subscribed to the channel, like the video, and comment your in-game username. And if you're new, register using the link in the description so no one can steal your reward. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. Man oh man, has it been a long time since I've been on the server Rune Wild. According to the command colon colon players, there are 198 people online and it's just early in the morning. This is definitely not the peak time. I highly advise you guys come check out the server if you haven't already. It's a very clean old school RS server and probably the best one around in my opinion. Boy, do we have a lot to do today. So normally I go out into the wilderness and just have some fun, but I'm actually going to take a look into the all-time achievements and try to get some of those done. Now obviously some of these will take some time, such as logging in for seven consecutive days, but right now I'm actually a bronze star for the achievement killing 200 players. If I take a look at the actual achievement tab, you get some pretty banger rewards from this, which can be used for some PvP supplies. And I'm actually less than 70 kills away from achieving this, so obviously I won't get it in this video, but I think that's something we should strive for in the near future definitely close to unlocking that achievement on top of this I think I'm gonna go ahead and knock out this risk 2 million and use 250 obelisk achievement because I'm pretty close to it getting done and I think if I run around and stuff like that in an ape setup I'll be able to defend myself and still be risking about that 2 million reward I think this one's really easy to claim as well so let's go ahead and get these done all right so the minimum requirement is like 2 mil if I take a look at colon colon risk I am risking well over that actually 20.3 million and I have enough to defend myself so we're gonna go out there into the obelisk and try to uh, get this done and hopefully we don't get seen by any teams the goal here is definitely to be non-confrontational but if I gotta open up a can of whoop ass I will holy crap it's mammoths look at these things they're magnificent and they're all attacking me could you imagine being hit by those big ass things all right, so definitely just want to keep using these over and over again and try to get out as quickly as possible. We are not going to chill around here for too long. What are those things right there? Those look really magnificent. They're called ants. They look like giant mushrooms. Don't eat them, boys, so you'll start tripping out. <laughs> We're about five minutes in and there's still no sign of anyone, so that's good. Oh my god, why is there so many white dots? Oh, it's my clan. No! What? Oh, what the fuck? Yo! <laughs> oh, man. Niggas are just chilling up here, dog. I was like, what the fuck? Well, I'm fooled. That kind of sucks. He accidentally TV'd me while I was doing my obelisk hunt. Some dude in Mystic just running around. Did he get full TV'd or something? I'm gonna chase after this guy and see what's up. What's his deal? Rest in peace. This guy's gonna get away. We'll never know his story, boys. We'll never know his story. Talk to me! Holy shit. We actually caught a freeze on him, boys. My rigor and augury isn't really swapped right now, so that's a problem. Yeah, I have no idea what this guy's deal is. Either way, I'm having... Fuck! I was having fun. What the fuck? <laughs> Yo, creep me the fuck out. I was like, what the fuck? <laughs> this is the last obelisk that we have to do, boys. Hopefully we don't run into a team, but we are completely done. Let's go. That part of the achievement is now complete. We have gotten 250 out of 250. We can now feast, boys. We have 800 angler fish to work with and some super combat potions. And who doesn't like grocery money, right? Okay. Wasn't really too worried about that. Oh, man. I really almost had him there. This is it. Ah, he was praying. Could have been a really good moment for us, but... You know, one big barrage could determine a whole lot right now. Oh, he tapped. Good fight, man. That was actually a really fun one. Sweet God Almighty, that was it. I just couldn't capitalize on it. Uh, oh my fucking god, that bolt that he hit, man. You know, I DC'd earlier, and I don't know who well was fighting, but they walked away with a free Darok set. <laughs> Pretty interesting. Oh, I didn't even have my prayers up. Imagine if I DC'd then. Oh god. Good fight claws, right? But they're here! And they suck. Maybe I should get rid of them. <laughs> oh my god, a 67! Good KO right there. We'll take it. You know what? I haven't really showed the Armored God Sword a lot of love in the... 
Are you kidding? He was 1 HP. Talk about some love, man. Oh my gosh. Armadillo Godsword is coming out hot already. Better than the Dragon Claws. Yeah. Oh, that could have been it. I tried to, like, delay him with a back step. Oh, man. Well, that one's a good one. We got him again with the same thing, so that kind of works. He's like, oh, shit. Oh, oh my God. <laughs> I was, I was really wanting to see how that played out, to be honest with you. And that seems to be the end result. Once I get a big XP stack, we're just going to go in for the kill, because this guy ran away from me last fight, and I didn't really get the opportunity to work him, so... Definitely just going to go in for the kill as soon as possible. I could have been right, to be honest with you, I didn't even need the ultimate strength, but, you know. Oh man, what a XP drop right there. Good fight, man. Whew, he just pulled out a fucking whip. I think he did. He pulled out a fucking whip. Alright, I'll let you whip me. Probably whip into G Mall. Yep. <laughs> Saw that one coming. Oh my god! 51 slash. Good fight, man. I actually got myself a red casket from that, so let's open that up. And I got an abyssal whip from a red casket, so that's actually pretty cool. And uh, this guy was risking, you know, something, so I was actually impressed with that kill. Age of Fury. This looks like a good guy to fight, to be honest with you. Looks like it's going to be a fun one, so that's who we're going to go up against. Probably going to go with the Armadillo God Sword first into the Granite Mall to ensure that I get a pretty decent hit. This guy needs to know what he's doing a little bit, so it should be a pretty good fight, to be honest with you. Alright, I'm game. I'll play your game. Looks like fun, to be honest with you. Looks like this guy might have done some free-to-play PKing in his past. I'm on. <laughs> that was a pretty good one, man. I'm not going to lie. I like this guy. He's actually pretty fun to fight. I don't have any ring of recoils on, I have a B-ring. Good fight. <laughs> okay, so Jack the Ripper. Jack Ripper is most definitely a bot. I think it's pretty obvious the way he's acting. We don't like bots around here. We're gonna go ahead and pounce on him. Yeet! Nothing. How about... Yeet! Oh my god. Just, you know, RNG testing real quick. See how my AGS specs are looking. What? It's got a red casket from a PK bot. Is that normal? Well, I got another whip, boys. It's like the second one. Hey, I'm not complaining. Attach a tent to that. Pretty good stuff. All right, boys. I hope you enjoyed this video. It's always hard to get back into the groove of things, especially when you're moving to a server you're not necessarily familiar with. I have a lot to learn on RuneWild, but I'm ready to take up the challenge. So I will be exploring all of the cool content that RuneWild has to offer so I can spice up these videos a little bit. Expect a lot of hype energy coming on the next few uploads, man. I'm really excited for this one. So make sure you guys enter the giveaway for 250 credits, and I will see you guys in the next RuneWild video. Peace!